So for this type of A-line, I'm going to use an arrow kit that's got a uh, wire. And so I'm going to feel a pulse here with my non-dominant hand, going at a roughly 45 degree angle until I see a flash of blood. Okay, so I've got my flash of blood there. So now I maybe lower my angle a little bit and advance this wire. Once that wire's in, I should be able to just advance the catheter over the needle. From this point, all I need to do is place gauze, hold pressure, remove my wire, and hook up, and we're done. Sometimes when doing this type of A-line, you're actually gonna insert the catheter too far and go through the other end of the artery and blow the artery. That's not that big of a deal because you can easily save this. And so the technique is we're gonna place gauze here, and then we're going to get our wire ready. So we are advance our wire through that needle there, and then we just pull this catheter back until we see pulsatile blood, and then we can advance our wire through the catheter. So I'm just gonna pull this back until I see blood coming back. Okay, there we go. So now I can advance this wire in. Now I advance my catheter over the wire. Then I'm gonna hold pressure here, but I'm gonna let up pressure here just real quick just to make sure that I'm in. Yep, I'm in. So I'm gonna hold pressure there, take my needle out, and now I can uh, hook up, and we've saved it and we're done. Palpating the pulse, insert the needle at a 45 degree angle to the skin, advancing slowly until you see flash black into the hub. Now that I see pulsatile blood flow into the hub, drop the angle. Now that I drop the angle of my catheter, I advance slowly and advance the catheter using a twisting motion over the needle. Now that the catheter is in, place gauze underneath the hub, apply pressure on the artery, pull out the needle, and attach to the transducer. Yeah, dude! If I accidentally pass the angiocath all the way through both lumens of the artery, we can still save this, but you will need a wire to do so. If you do not have a wire readily available, you can use one from an arrow kit. All you need to do is grab an arrow as well as a pair of scissors. What you do is advance the wire through the needle. Now just cutting through the plastic sheath and not the wire, cut the plastic portion off and you can pull the wire out. So by using the wire, go ahead and pull back on the catheter until you see blood flow. Now I am in the lumen of the artery, I can advance the wire in. Now that the wire is into the artery, I can advance the catheter over the wire, apply pressure, and pull out the wire. And I hook up with my transducer tubing.